What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Before we get started, do me a favor, hit the like, comment, subscribe, leave a comment, you know, whatever. Help your boy out. So, what we're going to do today, it's going to be a short little clip. Um, I was going to do a couple videos about getting the trans spacers in and the uh, subframe out, but I got a little hung up, so I'm going to hold off on that and uh, make a separate video. But for this video, what I'm going to do is, because I got my wheels in last week, I want to do a wheel uh, unboxing or whatever, and... Um, I also want to uh, show my lug, the lug nuts I got from 326 Power and my short and spindles. So, without further ado, let's, uh, let's check this shit out. Oh, and sorry, we're in my fucking kitchen. My fucking washer and dryer are going. I've got cans and bottles out and bags out in my back deck, so if you see those, no, it's not garbage, it's cans and bottles, okay? So fucking relax. So, first things first, let's do the fucking lugs. So, here's the lugs. Nothing crazy, 326 power, you know, Different end caps. I don't know if you can really see them. Oh yeah, there you go. Mm, come on. Yep. There's those. Like I said, nothing crazy. Red. And fucking ready to jam. So wheels. Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Oh, my wheels were fucking put together and fucking everything else uh, by VR. We. Oh my Jesus Christ! It is fucking sister. Oh yeah. Yep, so I got a pair of work VSKFs. I know some people are like, oh, I'm gonna put that on your access. Yep. And just because they're three piece wheels doesn't change how I feel about anything else. I'm just able to finally afford these. So after getting my shit together and fucking finally getting back into the groove of things, I fucking bought a set of three piece wheels. I don't know if you can really see it. Candy Red Spike Hardware, and you know, wheel specs are 18 by 10 for the front, six inch lip, 18 by 11, seven inch lip rears. Um, so yeah, I think they're all right. You know, I think they'll break neck. Uh, King Sport Gray Face, nothing crazy. Um, next, what I'll show you is the spindle yep cut and shortened 40 millimeters they look fucking great um i was gonna have one of the homies that follows uh stan shack and shit he was gonna do them for me i was gonna send them out um but with my suspension parts coming in, I just figured, fuck, let's just get them done and over with. Uh, so, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. So, that's where we're at. Um, Last week, uh, I did get the engine and trans uh, spacers in. I still got to put the fucking uh, engine mount bolts on. They were giving me fucking some issues, so I just stopped and walked away and just started taking some of the easy shit off the rear to get the subframe down. I worked on the subframe this weekend. Um, I've got it 98% out. The only thing I cannot get is fucking the uh, e-brake cables from the middle of the car. Um, you've seen where the car is. It's in a fucking, you know, in the hood garage. I'm working off jack stands and fucking minimal space. So if there's a different way to get those disconnected from the rear subframe, let me know in the comments or DM me. Um, 
it would be greatly, greatly fucking appreciated because that's all that's holding me up right now from getting them out. And then all I gotta do is fab them. Everything, I got all the material to do the fab work. Um, that's just what I gotta get done. So, and yeah, that's all it's holding me up. So I wanted to drop a video of at least this stuff. I'm not gonna drop a video of the subframe until I get it completely out and my Serial 9 stuff should be here hopefully, hopefully fucking next week. They keep saying, you know, this date and then fucking it gets pushed back, which it's all right, I get it. I totally understand. Um, they're a gnarly company and you know, especially with COVID shit going on too, it's just been a fucking pain in the fucking fat ass. So, um, so yeah, like I said, I just want to make a quick little update video on fucking have, getting my wheels, the spindles done. And then hopefully next week when I get all this shit completely out, I'll give you a little rundown. You know, I'll show you what I had to do uh, with the engine and trans spacers and getting the rear subframe out. Um, oh, send us rollers immediately. And uh, so yeah. So until next time, stay stoned, stay static, be fucking humble. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.